Florida State, the final regular season game of the year, coming up next. The temperature is perfect, 68 degrees. The wind south, 10 to 15 miles per hour. You saw the humidity, 65%. Now he comes off the horse here. It's the first time, the last part of the year, the last game, he jumps off the horse. Notice that the Florida Gators are out there. All right! six straight ball games to Florida previous to last year. Francis will kick it off. And down on the near side for Florida State. That's Keith Ross. And he's across the 30 to the 32-yard line. 27 yards on the return. Chip Ferguson's the quarterback from Charlotte, North Carolina. The running backs are Dane Williams and Sammy Smith. The wide receivers, Terry Anthony and Ronald Lewis. The tight end is Tom O'Malley. The center, Michael Tanks. The guards, Mike Morris and Jason Kuypers. The tackles, Joey Ayanata and Pat Tomberlin. Good ball. Personal foul on the kicking team. Great field position at their 48-yard line. Movement up front by Florida, and Ferguson's got a free play as flags are down. He is not a running quarterback as he slides safely into the 45-yard line as we'll check out the Florida defense for you. Jeff Roth is the nose guard. Guys on the end, tremendous. Trace Armstrong, Rondi Weston, 13 sacks between them. The inside backers, Joey Nicoletto and Pat Moore, their leading tackler. On the outside, Owen Bartriff and Huey Richardson. The secondary, Richard Fain and Kerry Watkins, the corners. And the safeties, Godfrey Miles and Bill Lang. It's first and five with the 47 of the Gators. Screen, Sammy Smith. And he's to the 41 yard line. Jerry Odom. Split backs. Smith on the draw, and he's done right at that 41 yard line. Florida, what have they done this year? They're second in passing defense, second in total defense, third in scoring defense, and 12th in rushing defense. Both wide receivers split to the top of your screen. This is Dane Williams, and Williams, he's met there by Joey Nicoletto. Terry Anthony splits to the top of your screen, Ronald Lewis to the near side. He's got his fullback, Dane Williams, inside the 30 to the 29, and that's a Florida State University first down. Wide receiver to the top of your screen, Lawrence Dossie's in there now, number 29. And that's where Ferguson goes to Dossie. At the 25-yard line, he's met by three white-shirted players on second and six. Sammy Smith, inside the 20, and another Florida State first down. First and 10 at the 18-yard line. Blitz coming. Dossie at the 15. Dossie inside the 10. Dossie! Touchdown! <laughs> Drews for the point after. He's hit 50 of 51 this year. And make it 51 of 52. 11.31 to go. First quarter. Florida State leads it by a touchdown. Roger Twino, Lee Corso, Chris Fowler here with you in Tallahassee, Florida. Richie Andrews to kick it off, Tony Lomack and Alonzo Sullivan back deep. And that's Lomack at the five. Lomack has his sideline at midfield. He is dragged down from behind and the man on the special teams. Gators offensively, Kyle Morris makes his seventh start of the year from Clinton, Mississippi. The running backs, Emmett Smith and Cedric Smith. Wide receivers are Terrence Barber and Tony Lomack, who made that fine kick return. The tight end is Mark McGriff. The center is Tracy Daniels. And the guards, Kevin Sills and Chris Bromley. The tackles for the Gators, David Williams and John Durden. For first and 10, it's at midfield.
Morris has got a receiver. It's his tight end, McGriff. Inside the 25 to the 24-yard line, 26 yards on the reception by McGriff and defensively for Florida State. Odell Higgins is the nose guard. Eric Hayes and Steve Gabbard, the defensive tackles. The backers on the inside, Kelvin Smith and Felton Hayes. And on the outside for the Knowles, Shelton Thompson and John Hatton. The secondary, what else can we say? Deion Primetime Sanders and Tracy Sanders, no relation. And the safety, Stan Shiver and Leroy Butler. First and 10 from the 23-yard line. Emmett Smith. He might have gotten back to the line of scrimmage. Second and eight. Open across the middle is McGriff again. The senior, third down and four. Near side, and Ernie Mills had it. He dropped it. There's a penalty marker down. Interference on the defense. First down. First and 10 at the 10-yard line. They can make a first down as Emmett Smith down to the two. And, folks, that's why he was the top freshman in the country a year ago. It's second down at the two, just over nine minutes to go. Morris. Morris gets back to the line of scrimmage on third down from the two. Emmett Smith. He didn't get it. Kelvin Smith was there at a meeting. Wait for that man to jump up. And you see, they've got about eight inches for the first down and about two more inches for the touchdown. Emmett Smith. Great second effort and touchdown, Florida. He was hit by Kelvin Smith in the backfield. To watch a Florida Gator hit Smith in the backfield right there. He hit him in the backfield, but look at that determination. He's got that strong link blocking touchdown for Emmett Smith. Point after by John Francis is good. And with 8.26 to go, first quarter, we're tied at seven. As John Francis kicks it off, and Keith Ross on the near side will let it go out of bounds. They'll throw the flag. And... It's Ross again at the eight-yard line. Outside. At the 40-yard line, he's brought down by John Spirito. First and 10. Sammy Smith. Across the 45 to the 47-yard line on second and five. Smith again. Across midfield and close to the first down. After the bowl game against Auburn. Third and one. Dane Williams. First down, Seminoles. Bruce Lassane and Dossie split to the near side on first and ten. Blitz by Florida. Smith. Sammy Smith to the 37-yard line. So who's going to be the star of this game? Second and one. Dane Williams. Inside the 35 to the 33. And Smith, five carries and 24 yards. First and ten from the 33. Sammy Smith. Good tackle on the far side of the 32-yard line. I think they really do believe that that helps him. Second down and nine. Ferguson. Oh, nearly picked off. Bill Lang. You made your point, that's for sure. Third down and nine. Penalty markers down. Ferguson. Oh, he's got him at the 15-yard line. That's Ronald Lewis. Foul, foul. Offside on the defense. Holding on the defense. Uh, Dossie, the sophomore, well, they had to come up with another. They're just four great ones is what they call it. First and ten now, Florida State. Down the middle, wide open. Touchdown, Tom O'Malley. <laughs> Rich 
Archie Andrews makes the extra point. And 4.56 to go. First quarter, Florida State leads it by a touchdown. Okay, thank you very much. Chris Short, line drive kick, and an up back for Florida. That's Curtis White. Ferguson, 67, 73 yards, two touchdowns as McGriff goes in motion. First and 10 for Florida. Intercepted. Intercepted at the 25-yard line. John Hadley. And the Knowles, first and 10 at the 25-yard line. Dane Williams right up the middle. They've established him on the inside as he gets Anthony and Lewis split to the near side on second and seven. Sammy Smith inside the 15. Look at him carry people down to the 10 yard line. We got first and 10 here at the 11 yard line. Smith inside the 10 down to the eight yard line. Lewis splits to the near side on second and seven. Going to Anthony. No. No good. That's depth, third and seven. They've completed nearly 50% of their third down opportunities this year. And Sammy Smith with a high step of touchdown Florida State. Richie Andrews is good for the third time. 2.56 to go. We played against each other in high school. I mean, some of them were seeing each other for the eighth, ninth year in a row. And that's a short kickoff. It's going to bounce out of bounds on the nine. Three touchdowns as Andrews, another kind of angling soccer-style kick. And I don't know what the problem is with the kickoffs tonight, Lee, but neither guy, I don't know. I think you'll just try to kick it down there as far as you can, huh? Now, Lomack, well, the up-back's going to take it. Curtis White, that's the second return he's had. Now, penalty marker goes down. Lefty, on the run back, 15 yards. Morris is checking off now at the line of scrimmage. Emmett Smith, he's to the 19. Hope you're enjoying the game so far tonight. 21-7, first quarter, second and six for the Gators. Emmett Smith at the 21-yard line. Third down and four. Three wide receivers now for the Gators. Bumble. Morris picks it up. He's got time. Well, he was trying to get it to Willie Sneed, number nine, on the far right side in the seven-yard line. And primetime Deion Sanders is going to have a chance to show you all what he can do. Just take a look. to the 39-yard line. And that was with no blocking. He's that good. First and 10 from the 39. Ferguson going first. This has been a long first quarter, hasn't it? <laughs> Gosh. That's Dexter Carter, number 13, who's come in there. He had a good game last year against the Gators. Draw play. Doesn't get much. Carter was the ball carrier. And the end of the first quarter. Florida State leads at 21-7. 27. And I'll tell you what. Florida was coming hard that time. Watkins at the 17. And he is stuck at the 20-yard line. We start the second quarter. Florida State leads it 21-7. And the Gators have a first and 10 from the 22-yard line. Lomax in motion. Morris. It was caught. It was caught on the far side by Lomax, and they say, no, he was not in bound. Don't worry about it. Throw it again. Second and 10. Willie McClendon, the freshman from Jacksonville. It's third down and nine for the Gators. Lomax in motion. 
penalty marker. Morris is dumped, and it was Shiver, 37. Third down and nine again from the 23. Across the middle. And they're... Yes, it is a reception. Lomack was there to make the great catch. Francis at the 15. And, of course, you just saw Deion Sanders. He's going to have a chance on this one. There's a hole. Oh, he just got tripped up, and a penalty mark is down, and he knew. He's flipping on the receiving team, 15 yards. Well, he's our first and 10, Florida State, at their 25-yard line. Sammy Smith to the 30-yard line. Second and four. Sammy Smith again. To the 36-yard line and a Florida State first down. Lewis Oliver is first and 10 now at the 36-yard line. Smith cuts it back to the right. Can he get outside? Sammy Smith to midfield. 14 yards in the pickup before Kerry Watkins finally makes the tackle. For Sammy Smith, first and 10 from the 50. As Ferguson. Far side, he's got his tight end O'Malley. To the 33-yard line with Bill Lang. Out of spring practice so we can look at the young ones. First and 10 from the 33. Carter. Dexter Carter. Second and three. Dane Williams to the 19-yard line on a nifty piece of running ball. Lewis Oliver is checked back into the game. First and 10 from the 19. Second and seven at the 16. And the Gators jump offside, and Carter will take it up the middle as penalty flags go down. Staff discovered Outside it. on the defense. And notify Lewis and Anthony are the wide receivers. Dane Williams inside the 10, and he should have enough for the first down. And other than the Kentucky game where they came from behind in the second half, Florida has not done that this year. On first and goal from the eight, and it's Dane Williams again, right up the middle. Second and goal from the six yard line. Ferguson. Nailed at the 14 by Joey Nicoletto. Third down. And goal from the 12. Sammy Smith inside. Sammy Smith to the two-yard line. And Florida State has sent in Bill Mason to attempt the field goal. And from 18 yards out, he's good. And the Seminoles lead it 24-7. The Seminoles have a 24-7 lead, and Richie Andrews kicks it off, and Lomack, they fake the reverse, and Lomack's got room to the near side. At the 40-yard line, he's knocked out of bounds. Now Morris is checking off at the line of scrimmage, and a penalty marker goes down. He's got a man wide open, and it was Willie Sneed on the far side. Legal procedure. Illegal motion on the offense. Okay, first and 15 after the penalty, and that's Emmett Smith, who's to the 39-yard line. And it's second down and 11 now, with 5.13 to go, first half. A screen over to the far side, Emmett Smith, and a good play over there. you got to keep a little tradition in the game, don't you, Lee? Absolutely. Third and nine from the 41. Morris, boy, his receiver, Terrence Barber, 27-yard line, and Deion Sanders is back at the 24. Good job by the Florida special teams as Sanders. Ferguson now checking off at the line of scrimmage. Sammy Smith. And he's across the 25 to the 27-yard line. It'll yes. be a long at halftime. Second and seven, and the penalty markers go down. Knowles, good ball. call. Ball start on the offense. Those Florida State, if you'll notice, will drop down, and they're in a three-point stand. 
second and 12. Ferguson going to the far side, and it's intercepted. Intercepted on the far side by Richard Fain. Third interception of the year for Fain. So first and 10 for the Gators at the 35 with a chance to make something happen here in the closing moments of the first half as Emmett Smith trying to hop his way inside the 35, second and nine now. 2.55 to go first half. And they go right up the middle to Cedric Smith. His first carry of the night down to the 20-yard line. And first and 10 from the 20. Both wide receivers split to the near side. Emmett Smith with a seam. Smith knocked out of bounds at the 10-yard line, and he'll be just shy of the first down. Just shy of the first down, second and one at the 11. Emmett Smith. And he's to the 10. He'll have enough for the first down. Let's get so it's first now, first and 10. They can get a first down without scoring as they give it. Up the middle to Cedric Smith. And he gets a couple. Split Emma Smith now out to the far side. Now he comes in motion to the near side. Morris throwing across the grain. And there were two or three players who get at least three to make a 24-10. Third down and seven. Down the middle. And the pass was badly thrown, and Morris was nailed. Stan Shiver was one of the men back there to hit him, as John David Francis will come on to attempt the 25-yarder. And it's good. So Francis, now 17 of 24 in field goals this year, and has a 14-point lead. Gators get set to kick it off. 117 to go, first half. And Ross to the 29-yard line, so with three timeouts remaining, they'll come out and they'll try to get another one. Reverse. No, they fake it. Smith still has it. Inside the 30, or across the 30, excuse me, to the 32-yard line. It's the first time I've ever seen him go into a shell with this much time to try to get, to not get another touchdown. It's curious, isn't it? Are they going to run it again? Sammy Smith is dragged down from behind now. They're up to the 38-yard line. We've reached halftime at Doe Campbell Stadium in Tallahassee, Florida. And Florida State holds a 24-10 lead over the Gators. And let's go back to our ESPN studios and Tim Brando. Tim, we're set to go. Andrews to kick it off as Lomack across the 20 to the 23-yard line. And Herbert Perry is in there, quarterback. That was Brian Davis, 39, who also was in on that tackle. So first and 10, Perry. The new quarterback for the Gators, and they give it to Emmett Smith right up the middle across the 25. Lomack in motion to the near side. As they pitch it back to Emmett Smith, picking his way through, and he's got a first down at the 34-yard line. Emmett, they just have not been able to throw the ball that well since Stacy Simmons was injured early this year as Lomack goes in motion to the far side on first and 10. And nowhere to go for Cedric Smith. But Florida's got to come out and throw the ball to move it on. They split in the grip, the tight end of the near side on second and nine. All day to throw, and Perry threw it right in the hands. Perry's checking off at the line of scrimmage. Penalty markers are down, and Lee, every time they've checked off the, the penalty, too much time against Florida, third and 14. And intended for Emmett Smith, that was just a bad pass. And they're famous for punt blocks. Low snap, but a good kick. Sanders, the fair catch at the 34-yard line. And Monk Bontesorte has the all-time Florida State record of 15 as... The Knowles take it first and ten, and Sammy Smith trying to pick his way through, but the 
Florida defense as both wide receivers. Barber and Anthony split to the top of your screen. Dane Williams right up the middle, and Joey Nicoletto came busting through to trip him up. That's how much he loves it. They found that at Purdue University. Right. That's where it was found. It. Third down and seven. Ferguson putting it up. Ronald Lewis is out there, and penalty markers go down. So there's no flag on that one because no the ball flag. is uncatchable. The ball is uncatchable. City of Florida's Kerry Watkins. Nice high spiraling punt. Driving Watkins back inside the 10. He loses it and loses it in the end zone. And number 31 for Florida State, Marion Butts, falls on it for a touchdown. Stadium in Tallahassee as Andrews will kick it off and deep and out of bounds on the far side. Let's go to Chris Allen. Chris, under Bob Martinez, of course, like a true politician, sitting on both sides, shaking a few hands. Good Tampa man, former uh, mayor of the city of Tampa. In college football. Holding on the kicking team. The first and ten is Kyle Morris, who's back in the quarterback at the 20 yard line. Excuse me, that's still Perry. Emmett Smith. He's got nowhere to go. Kelvin Smith, 36, so it's second down and 11. Intercept, no! Tracy Sanders had it in his hands. And now they've taken too much time, so... Sanders, now that's on the Florida, by the Florida bench, third down and 16 from the 14-yard line. Penalty markers down. Dead ball, delay of game on the offense. Another delay of game. And now it's third down and 21. to the 15-yard line where he is stuck by Felton Hayes and Tracy Sanders at his one-yard line. Bad kick off the side of his foot. But it turns over for him, and it will end up right at midfield, called the 49-yard line, 35 yards in the punt. Holding on the receiving team. Loose ball foul, be penalized. First and 10. Ferguson, Ronald Lewis, inside the 45. Another first down for Florida State, first and 10 from the 43 of the Gators. Sammy Smith, little stutter step, he's got it to the outside. Watch out. Inside the 30, the 20-yard line, and to the 17-yard line, where Joey Nicoletto, first and 10 from the 17-yard line. Smith again. But he's grabbed in the backfield by Rondi Weston, the senior, for doing a little negotiating with the coach. Second down at 17. Hit Smith right in the hands at the 20-yard line. Well, it's rained in the three previous games here against Florida and Tallahassee, but it looks like it's going to be a different outcome tonight. Ferguson down the middle. He's got his tight end, O'Malley. What a big game for Tom O'Malley, the senior from Darien, Connecticut. Fourth down. And one, Ferguson coming around and diving for the first down. And it's going to be very, very close. And you can see the moisture collecting on the football. Sammy Smith. And he had a hard time holding on to the ball just then. Florida State leads it 31 to 10. Ronald Lewis is the lone wide receiver as Sammy Smith gets it one more time. Smith inside the five, down to the two-yard line. Trace Arms, he's the man that recovered that fumble in the end zone, and he's set up on the wing on the near side as they give it to Dane Williams. Touchdown, Florida State. Point after is good and was 
6.49 to go in the third. Florida State leads it 38 to 10. The left side of the line, 69, Ayanata, 60, more just blows the Florida line back at number 49, 220 pound Williams scores for Florida State. Roger Twaddle, Lee Corso, Chris Fowler back with you as Andrews kicks it off. Boy, with a little bit of wind to his back, all of a sudden he's a different kind of kickoff. <laughs> Deflected, intercepted. Intercepted. Touchdown, Florida State. Odell Wiggins was the man who took it in. the point after and it's good 45 10 640 left to go in the third <laughs> 45 10 as Andrews is getting the work out here and he sends it down to Tony Lomax who will count it in the end zone and first and 10 for the Gators from the 20 and They'll try to get something working on the ground as Emmett Smith takes it right up the middle to the 27. It's just, it's been unbelievable. I can tell you years ago, it was all the other way. McGrady, right up the middle. And he gets to about the 33-yard line. First and 10. And they'll run it again. Emmett Smith. He's up to the 39. And that'll bring Willie McClendon into the game. Second and four from the 39 yard line. And that's McClendon, the freshman. And he has enough for the first down. So he can play against Illinois in the All-American Bowl. First and ten from the 45 yard line. And Sammy Smith was another player that got a lot of preseason hype. Second and six. McClendon. And he is stuck over there. As he crossed midfield, he breaks the Florida State attendance record. So a record crowd here tonight on third down and four. Checking off, and he's got to hurry now. And finally at the 46-yard line, Phil Carolla. And he's back at his... 15-yard line, and that putt angles to the far side, and will bounce out of bounds at the 25, and first and 10 from the 25-yard line. Ferguson, that was an interesting call right there. So, Peter Tom Willis are going to try it to Dossie on the end around. Armstrong misses him. Dossie still on his feet, spins to the 34-yard line. So, 149 to go, third quarter, 45-10, Florida State leads it. Marion Butts is the fullback, and he's got the first down across the 35-yard line. First and 10, 117 to go, third quarter. And Dexter Carter dropped behind the line of scrimmage by Trace Armstrong, and they need the time they'll have now that next month to get ready for Illinois. As Peter Tom Willis has dumped the man in there, Rondi Weston, his seventh sack. We've been third period of play. Campbell Stadium in Tallahassee, third down and 18 for Florida State, and Peter Tom Willis is the quarterback, and he swings it to the near side, and that's Dexter Carter. And Watkins is back for Florida. And pressured that time and off the side of the foot. And that'll roll out of bounds at the 37-yard line. Took him to the number two spot in the nation. Pitch back to McClendon. He can't handle it as they wanted to try to run the reverse. Okay, thank you, Tim. Second down and 17, and they lose the football. Morris not able to get a handle on it, but it led them in their final eight games to a perfect 8 0 record. They finished 9 1 and 1, and that 84 team was crowned national champion by a couple of publications. As Herbert Perry throwing downfield to the 40 yard line, Lomack not able to come up with it in Tallahassee since 1980. 
strike are going to end that particular hex as Deion Sanders takes it. Still going, still going to midfield, crawling forward. <laughs> Looking for the 10th straight victory. They lead at 45-10, 12-32 to go. Fourth quarter, Peter Tom Willis has replaced Chip Ferguson and hands the ball off up the middle. And for Florida State as they go deep, second and two. Ronald Lewis to the 30-yard line. Do not bet against Bobby Bowden in bowl game. Willis trying to throw it near side. Or they have played this year a number of teams who will be going to bowls. And we'll tell you more about that in just a moment. Second and ten. And that's Floyd. And Floyd is down to the 11-yard line. First and ten. Zenon it straight up the middle, Florida State running back Keith Ross. That's why Galen Hall is having a tough time winning this year, just doesn't have enough depth. Second and nine. Peter Tom Willis throwing it to the near side. Jerry Anthony, touchdown! leads it 52 to 10 against the rival the University of Florida but he'll give a player freedom to let the personality come out I think you know you need that on the team when you've got 70 or 80 guys as the kickoff drops down around the 20 yard line and for the University of Florida okay Huskers gets Miami in the Orange Bowl big catch for you guys that's gonna be a great game you know uh, Miami has beaten Nebraska by one point the last time they were there you better believe it second and one now for Florida as the Gators send over the right side Dexter McNabb 9-25 first and 10 for the Gators and Perry is sacked 93 Shelton Thompson with the best defense statistically in the country second down and 22 Run down the middle and intended for a 14 Ernie Mill. Third down and 22 for Herbert Perry and the Gators. Going down the middle and he's got his man. Goodness, he hung on to the football. First and 10 from the 43 and straight up the middle there. School football players. A school, so therefore he would have never gotten a throw like McClendon with the new rule. As McClendon carries the ball there to the 35-yard line. Head coach of McCoody. Third down and two. And that's way short. But the whole town was here. Fourth down and two, McClendon. First down, Florida down to the 29-yard line. We're He's so far and strong, guys. Chris, he was looking at you with kind of a mean yeah. stare there. You better move away. Well, he didn't look too happy about that rumor, Chris. I if he doesn't win that bowl game, what's going to happen? There's just a lot of pressure on that job at the University of Florida. As Perry completes the pass over on the far side. He knows that Galen Hall can do the job, and he'll stick with him. I mean, if it's his decision. I think with a solid quarterback, this could be a much different team, but that just hasn't been the case this year. It follows us with all of our red shirts and becomes a hero. He sends you a thank you note yeah. for all those good players you left in. Second and ten. Pressure's on Perry again, and he throws it short. Four senior running backs that want to sign some backs in case Sammy Smith decides to go to the pro, fellas. McClendon, the face mask. That's it. 15 that's, yard, that's, automatic first down. It's the end. First and goal from the three yard line. McClendon. He gets down to the one. Period. Second and goal from the two. McClendon again, and Shiver came from the outside. A lot of these guys have not had a lot of playing time because they've rested a lot. So, a third and goal. Touchdown, Florida. Boy, they kept battling, and McClendon finally punched it in there. That's good for McClendon to score against in his first Florida, Florida State game. And 
looks good. 52-18. get the feeling these Seminole fans are savoring this blowout here this evening. As Bobby Bowden changed places with Galen Hall right now. Galen Hall would win with the Florida State team. Casey Weldon is in at quarterback right now. And the handoff up the middle. And can come off to a round of applause on second down and four. We're going to go to Chris Fowler in just a moment. Folks, we've got, a, we've got something for you that you don't want to miss. This is history we're talking about here. Weldon, the pitch back. And that's Keith Ross still going. Ross has got a chance to go all the way. He's caught from behind by Kerry Watkins at the 16-yard line. Straight up the gut. That was Victor Floyd. We got one that no one else Tom Nugent wanted to do that, didn't he? He knew what it was all about. <laughs> Around the left side, Victor Floyd. And by the way, Vic Prinzi, who is a great... He's got everything here in Florida State to win a national championship. And one last play with the clock running down. Keith Ross. That ends this game from Dope Campbell Stadium in Tallahassee, Florida, and Florida State with their biggest margin of victory ever against the Gators. The final score, Florida State 52 and Florida 17.